here we go this is the robot that I made it's uh, basically made of uh, three stepper motors it's a robotic arm controlled by a PLC, a Micrologix 1000 and what I made it is uh, can sense the size of the object I have two objects over here actually I have three but two two of them pretty much the same which is the blue one and the yellow one now let me, let's start with the um, blue one so let's see where the robot is going to take and all I need just to place it and wait it will take it automatically and it will take around 30 seconds to take it to the second position you see in here my robot is not that fast because I'm using a stepper motor which it doesn't have uh, high torque I got it out of scanners so here is the first one took it 90 degrees clockwise now let's throw the red one let's see where it's gonna take it should take it 90 degrees counterclockwise and here we go and only just replace it and wait and here it picks it up cool and after that we can try the yellow one you see throw it over there kinda cool I can even control the degrees on this one but mm, I've decided to make it 90 degrees I could make it actually bigger but who cares now let's try this one it can sense the size by using uh, a diet lasers which is um, got out of dollar store there's two of them over there and there is a over here the photo sensors same thing got them from dollar stores so this robot is not that much expensive cost me to make it cost me around uh, let's say 100 bucks it didn't cost me that much but I have to do a lot of work and a lot of programming now let's do the actually let's do the other one again and see should take it to exactly the same place as before Look at that. It's kind of cool, eh? Uh oh. Just dropped it. Well, we can fix that. Well, the problem with this one the torque on the stepper motor on the arm is not that strong enough, so let's just put it back again. Hope it's going to pick it up. Well, I waited a long time. There we go. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, and it's up. So I should take it up there. And after this one, let's try the red one again. There is the big dude over here. Cool. Took me almost a week to work on this one with the planning and everything, AutoCAD designing. I had to do some modification for the design. I have to put some weights on the other side just to count cause the weight on the other two sides, make it kinda equal. So there will be no side powers on the motor. Hmm, kinda cool. Took it to the other side, exactly what I was supposed to do. And here is my robot. Thanks for watching. Take care.